Welcome back to Susie Anderson Home. Today we're sharing our ideas for decorating an elegant and timeless conservatory. Conservatories are glass structures that add incredible charm and functionality, allowing you to enjoy the natural beauty of the outdoors within the comfort of your home. To start, even though we'll be covering conservatories, the same styling tips can be applied to orangeries and sunrooms. Orangeries were seen in the grounds of stately homes throughout the 17th and 19th centuries, where their original purpose was to house and protect citrus trees from the frost. They feature brickwork, an inset or flat roof and dwarf walls. They were architecturally designed to be a supporting structure and can be attached to the main house or positioned elsewhere in the garden. Conservatories were inspired by orangeries to maximise natural light for plant growth, whilst offering a greater level of versatility in their purpose and style. They typically feature a fully glazed frame and at least two thirds of the roof and more than half of the wall area made from glass. These structures stand out architecturally and are attached to the home separated by external walls, doors and windows. Like conservatories, some rooms prioritise the abundance of natural light but are more restrained in their design. Roofs can either be full or partial glass and they are seen as an extension separated by the internal walls and doors. The most prized feature of conservatories is the large floor to ceiling windows which facilitate a strong connection with the outdoors. Bifold or French glass doors are great to open the space to an outdoor seating area, vegetable garden or bull lawn in the spring and summer months. In hotter climates, solar controlled glazing can be installed as can double glazed windows for cooler climates. Roofs are fully glazed and designs can include simple lean-to, hipped, gable end or traditional Victorian, Georgian and Edwardian style. Finishings include crestings and finials. Finials are the pointed feature at the front of the apex and the cresting runs along the ridge of the roof. These are more prevalent in traditional designs. Next, determine the purpose of the space. Consider year-round living and decide if you want to use the space for entertaining, relaxing and lounging, or even as a multi-purpose setup. Some options include a family sitting room, a garden room, home office, a creative space or art studio, a casual dining room, games room, or even a kitchen and entertaining space. For a soothing aesthetic, 
tiled flooring options include marble, porcelain or ceramic tiles, travertine, slate, flagstone, bluestone or reclaimed limestone flooring. These are practical, stylish and can withstand extreme temperature changes. If you're building from scratch, underfloor heating can be installed for comfort and cosiness. For a rustic and relaxed feel, a well-engineered timber floor, terracotta tiles or even crushed granite are great options. Large area rugs can be included for colour, pattern and warmth underfoot. While little artificial light will be needed during the day, to carry the same warm glow from day to night, incorporate a variety of ceiling, wall, floor and table lights. Options include an elegant crystal, iron or wooden chandelier as a focal point, a large ceiling pendant to zone a dining nook, floor lanterns grouped into corners, table candelabras for ambience, and slender floor and table lamps for task lighting. Window treatments are used sparingly to maintain the open, airy and relaxed feel. However, if you wish to create some sun protection and insulation, select the lightest possible blinds crafted from rattan or linen in neutral hues. Blinds are stylish yet subtle in their visual impact, shading out the hot sun in the warmer months and conserving heat in the winter. The furniture you select will depend on the purpose of the space and the feeling you wish to evoke. For casual lounging, lightweight seating options include a hanging egg chair, cane-backed rocking chair, Lloyd Loom woven seats, rattan Wengler chairs or a wicker lounge or settee. Complete the look with complimentary coffee and side tables or glazed ceramic drum stools with painted motifs. To maximise space, window seating can be custom built around the perimeter of the room or to zone a smaller dining nook. Other dining furniture options include a wrought iron framed French bistro set, marble tabletops on iron bases, tilt top tables or a recycled timber trestle table paired with foldable chairs.
Look to multi-purpose pieces. For example, a daybed can double as a sofa. A folding trestle table can function as a dining table, drink station, desk or console. A bar cart is great for entertaining, as well as housing garden tools. And a storage ottoman can serve as a coffee table, footrest or extra storage. When it comes to texture and materials, ensure any upholstery or fabrics are light fast and that furniture and decor can hold up in the sun so they don't fade out. Rattan can be painted white, black, natural or feature a gentle washed finish. Wrought iron takes on a gentle patina over time, meaning sustained light exposure will only enhance the rustic appeal. Look to throws in soft, earthy neutrals and groupings of hand block printed cushions for visual interest, colour and dimension. Hop sack fabrics and natural linens are lightweight and breathable options. Celebrate the natural surroundings with patterns of florals, stripes and botanicals in table linen and soft furnishings. For a cohesive look, we recommend sticking to either a warm or cool colour palette. Use the joining wall to showcase a beautiful collection of botanicals, floral or still life canvas prints displayed in a series. Garden artistry such as stone statues, wall plaques made from stone or composite resin, water features and obelisks all serve as elegant and timeless focal points or a backdrop, especially in lush garden rooms, creative studios and tea rooms. As always, include something loved, something living and something with luster. Unique pieces may include taxidermy, a baker's stand, ornate bird cages, tiered cake stands, a large sculptural clamshell or coral, bird baths and collections of ceramic vases in chinoiserie blue and white ginger jars, vases and planters. For luster, crystal water jugs, glasses, drinks dispensers, vases and platters can adorn conservatory tables and consoles. Bring the outdoors in with handmade wreaths, 
dried hanging herbs or flowers, bowls of acorns, lichen branches and vases of fresh green foliage. Celebrate the seasons with beautiful unstructured floral arrangements picked straight from the garden or from the local farmer's market. Add height and draw the eye up with hanging plants or urns of philodendrons and palms positioned on plant stands and plinths. For colour and drama, fill empty corners with orangery style planter boxes or terracotta glazed pots with citrus trees and tall reaching plants. Lastly, select pots, planters, vases and urns that offer visual beauty serving as sculptural pieces when filled or empty. For ideas on selecting the right vessel for your space, we recommend you watch our video on how to decorate with living energy. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you feel inspired to incorporate some of these conservatory style tips in your own home. And remember when designing a home you love, the beauty is in the detail.